so omg uh, literally just diagnosed someone with a vsd which stands for ventricular septal defect so his though may be risky because there's some aortic insufficiency but it's just a little bit so um we're not too sure whether or not we should close that right now he's completely asymptomatic and he's well let me not say his age but he's a teenager so hasn't had any problems but we're gonna just discuss with the rest of the team like with some surgeons or whatever maybe another cardiologist or whatever to see if it requires closure or not but I really felt for that mom because I mean you know of course she wants to take care of her son you know the best she can um, she was you know also just concerned about cost for the potential surgery that may have to happen where we may have to you know close the VSD um, and so yeah so the mom was worried about cost which is definitely understandable because you know she's a single mom she doesn't have much you know she let us know um, and so just it just really made me feel for her so we're really trying to see what the potential cost of it may be and like any assistance that can be provided to her um, regarding costs and everything like that but man like I just really felt for that mom um, but you know there are definitely other patients that we see every day that have that same complaint or worry so man I just and things like this I just wish healthcare was just more affordable to people um, so that you know everyone just gets the care that they deserve you know instead of like deciding like oh like am I gonna keep my son alive but let him die so but anyway that was very interesting um, I basically diagnosed it I was I like I said I told mom I was like look if it was up to me, your son would get an echo. But I was like, you know, but my, my um, you know, cardiologist is going to come check him out. And so, you know, she may say echo as well. If not, then, you know, I would trust her judgment, blah, blah, blah. But I let the mom know if it was up to me, I would do the echo. Because I definitely hear a murmur that does not change with position changes. Like it does not get louder or softer or whatever. It's more importantly, it does not get softer with position changes. Um, so, yeah, and I told my attending, I was like, that is definitely a murmur. And I told her what I thought it was, and it was actually that. So, that was actually pretty cool. Um, and so we did the echo, and then we saw it. And I was like, when my um, attending was like, VSD, I was like, woo, and like clapping a little bit. <laughs> Just because, you know, that the diagnosis was right so <laughs> so anyway um yeah i just wanted to come on here and share that a little bit as i'm walking to lunch so i'll hit y'all up later deuces